Warning, this is a super sarcastic video. If you hate sarcasm or just can't take a joke, please leave now. Thank you. So, this this guy, he made a reaction video of one of my videos. Why? My videos are perfect in every possible way, okay? I don't just put out content that I just make and then don't fix later because I'm lazy. No. Instead, I make content that's obviously perfect in every way possible, and he doesn't care. You know why? Because he thinks he's perfect in every possible way, which isn't true. So we're going to react to his video. And no, I'm not going to react to his video. I'm going to point out all the flaws in all of his arguments. You know why? Because he is wrong. And yes, I'm holding this mic because I don't have a stand right here. This would be awesome if I had a stand right here, but I don't have a stool. So we're just going to watch the video. And I'm going to prove him wrong. In that video, he gave five points. So I'm going to review those points. One is that the YouTube channel should have a little hover over and it'll show you if, or it'll give a star next to it if it produces content. You can be able to tell that most of the time by subscriber count. So that point, I don't actually agree with. I think that's stupid. I, I mean, not, it's not stupid per se, but it's useless. But he does make a second point that I, I kind of agree with. What he says is you should hover over and they say when they last made a video, which isn't fair for people like, let's say, Julian Smith or Tom Scott. So what I would suggest instead is show their most recent video. When you hover over, it'll create a box, or you can click a little thing, arrow, and it'll show their most recent video when it was released and their most popular video. Instead of having a star next to the name, like he suggests, I say their name should just be a different color. Like, everybody is gray except for people who actually post videos and they have a blue name. You see, wait, wait, right here we can see that Number Blue doesn't understand. What I'm saying is, if there was a star there, smaller YouTubers like me will be noticed more and then I will get more subscribers and more views and maybe I can, I don't know, monetize my videos. And that box thing is just an extra feature. I said that if they do the star, they can do this as well, okay? I'm not saying one or the other, I'm saying they need to use the star first and then they can add the boxes. Adding the, just the boxes would be stupid. I understand that. He's saying one or the other. I'm saying both or none or just the star. And he said that you should change the channel names to colors. No, no, no. You're not thinking about the colorblind people, Number Blue. You should know. I mean, your channel name is Number Blue. It's blue, okay? You should, you out of all people should know about colorblind people. Yeah, they exist. You want to know? Because I know one in person, okay? So I obviously know what I'm talking about. The second way would be an easier way to find YouTube messaging. All they would need to do is add YouTube messaging to the sidebar, but no. Instead, they bury it as if they're hiding a dead body. Yeah, actually, I don't have a problem with this point. This is good. Of course, obviously I'm right. See, he even agrees that I'm right, meaning my video is 100% perfect and right in every way possible. See, and you know what? Number Blue isn't that bad of a guy. Actually, no, I don't want to say that. Greg, can you cut that out make, and make me edgier? Like add, I don't know, uh, like hard rock, like Screamo, even though I hate Screamo, just cut that part out too. And just add like something else to make me look edgy, so. Thanks, Greg. Point three is a little more difficult than he would make it out to be. Technology is to the point where it may work, but is there's so many videos getting put on YouTube that it'd be just, it'd be too much. So what I would suggest, instead of having YouTube do everything, what it should be is like how they do the subtitles now, which is they have the community throw in subtitles and also the creator of the video can also throw in subtitles. But instead, what happens is they mark the points where there are swear words. And it will bleep or cut out the it'll cut out the audio and bleep those moments for however long it says it. And then it's a setting you can turn on and off if you want it or not, just like subtitles. And I think that would be a better option. See, he's basically agreeing it with me at this point. If you really think about it, he's just restating it in a way to make it look like he's more important than everybody else. Which isn't true, because I'm obviously way more important than him. I have more subscribers, making me more important as a person, an individual, and as a YouTuber. The point is, I have 60 subscribers now. I'm popular, okay? People watch my videos. It doesn't matter. Views don't matter. It's watch time. Why else would you think that I made a 14-minute video on my channel? I gotta get the watch time up 
so that way people I don't know watch my videos more that's why I had a one minute video and then it jumps to 15 minutes wow I really ranted there Greg can you cut that down please thank you YouTube, do you realize how difficult it is to copy URLs? Stop complaining, this isn't that hard, you just push a button, it's fine. When I'm in the creator studio, and I go to videos, and when I click this tab, and I- Wait a minute. End cards? What are you doing, you're getting off topic, stop it. Y YouTube, did you- D Did you fix it? Nope. It's just another feature. However, I have to admit, it is pretty cool. I mean, if you look at- Wait a minute. Wait. What's this? Okay, listen, you had me going for a minute. I was gonna listen to what you said, but then you changed it again. Stop! I don't know what you're talking about! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now, Number Blue? Seriously? It's called comedy, okay? If I were to just make a list video without comedy, nobody would watch it. What's the point of making a list video or a five ways to whatever video if you're not going to make it somewhat funny, okay? The last two points are supposed to be funny, okay? Because if you watch till the end of the video, it's like, okay, great, I guess I watched that video. You got to make it funny. You got to make people want to watch your next video, okay? So you have to add something comedic, in my opinion, if you're in the entertainment business. See, the whole point of point four is comedy, okay? It's supposed to be funny, You're supposed to laugh, ha ha, jokes are funny, okay? So, laugh, please, please. Instant video notifications. Now listen, YouTube, if I'm subscribed to somebody, I don't want to know if a video of theirs is posted two minutes after it's posted, oh no. I want to know the very second it's posted. This point's stupid, I think it was just meant to be comedy. Cause, yeah, that's stupid, it's two minutes. Well, you're two minutes! Wait, that didn't make sense. Greg, make sure to cut that out, thank you. You're a good editor. I, I appreciate it. Yes, more comedy, ha ha, laugh, funniness. See, okay, see, you gotta make it funny, okay? I, I said this before, comedy, yeah. Otherwise, my video is dead and nobody's gonna watch it. If it's just some boring video. Here's why I did a bunch of different variations, like I did the slow fade in, I did the stick man thing, which is stupid. Some people like it, some people don't. I did like the sad thing at the end. I did PNGs moving across the screen. I did fade ins, fade outs. I did a lot of different stuff. And Number Blue apparently doesn't care. He doesn't care and it's sad. It's sad to think that we live in a world where you can just make a reaction video and you think that you're not gonna hurt anybody else's feelings but you really do hurt other people's feelings inside. And it's really a tough time because you spent hours and hours making this thing that you hope people will enjoy and you hope people will laugh and maybe cry depending on what video you're doing. The reason I do this channel is to entertain people, make them laugh, make their day. And I've been trying to do that and Number Blue has made me look like some idiot when I'm trying to help other people. And I know people are like, how are you helping other people? I'm trying to brighten people's day, okay? I'm I want to make people laugh. And some of the time that doesn't work. Most of the time that doesn't work. 95% of the time it doesn't work. But I try. And so thank you for watching. If you... <laughs> okay, I just wanted to say, I, Number Blue is my friend. This is a super sarcastic video. Actually, Greg, can you please add a, uh, a thing? At like a disclaimer at the beginning saying this is a super sarcastic video because I realized that this is all for fun obviously so just make sure to add something at the beginning that doesn't like trigger anybody like I was triggered so just make it like something that's not gonna draw people away but if they don't like sarcasm or they aren't good at taking jokes well then just they're free to leave so that's what I want you to do Greg thank you Hey everyone, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, please press the like button and subscribe for more content. And if you do subscribe, please be sure to press the bell icon so that way you'll know whenever I post a video. Also, I have some links down in the description to some other stuff that I'm involved in, so if you want to check that out, that'd be awesome. And thank you for watching, and I will see you later, so goodbye!